So we are finally, finally, about a week from the official launch of Stellar Blade and fans and reviewers are finally getting their hands on review copies. It's about that time we talk about pre-launch preparations. Let's begin. Oh my God. Okay, it's happening. What's up everybody, it's your boy Saga bringing you awesome fast information regarding all things PlayStation Gaming. If you enjoy content that respects your time, hit the like button to get this video out to other gaming fans. But if you didn't, drop a dislike so I know exactly where to improve. So yeah, in just over one week from now, you'll be able to jump in and play arguably one of my most anticipated games of 2024 for PlayStation with Stellar Blade. To that end, let's go over some launch day preparations so you can jump right in on launch. Before we do that though, I am selecting one of the winners for the giveaway for a free copy of Stellar Blade and the winner for today is AT. Now I don't think you're that surprised on this win considering you comment on every Stellar Blade video so statistically you are going to win. Congratulations. Down in the description there will be a link to the discord if you could join it that would make things a tad bit easier and for everyone else feel free to drop by the discord as well would love to have you there. Thanks again AT and everyone for the support. Keep in mind if you want to still possibly win the last copy of the Stellar Blade giveaway all you need to do is like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Good luck and let's continue. So if you haven't pre-purchased Stellar Blade yet, you may not have noticed. I guess it is in the middle of the week, so there's a good chance you may not have noticed just in general. But according to the Stellar Blade app menu screen thing on PlayStation, it looks as though you can actually preload the game starting tomorrow or at 12 o'clock midnight your local time. For those of you who are not watching this video on the 18th when I'm posting it, this is April the 19th, 2024. If you're watching this video in the future, you should consider jumping on that right away so you can jump in whenever the game comes out. Now, how much space will you need? So far from the PlayStation Store, it says that you need a total of 30.4 gigabytes of space. I actually just got my PlayStation 5 like one day after the demo release of Stellar Blade, so my PlayStation is fairly clear. I literally only have Fortnite on my PlayStation, so I'm pretty good to go. Don't you dare make fun of me for not having any games. I literally only have Stellar Blade right now. Now it says it's only 30.4 gigs, but if I were you, I would probably save maybe an additional 30 to 40 gigs. There's a good chance that there will be a day one patch and increase that a bit. So having that extra space could save you some time and help you jump in faster. Besides that, I did notice that over on Twitter, a few creators got their hands on a pre-release copy of the game and that the embargo should be released on the 24th. So if you're interested in seeing if the game is worth jumping into, maybe check out some of those creators. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Anyway, Stellar Blade is quickly approaching and in no time Time, we'll get our hands on one of the games on PlayStation poised to be the best launch of 2024. The video on screen now goes over just that. Check it out. 